Hi everyone, so I will talk about a, a little bit about big data. There is a lot of information about big data on, on the internet, but I was doing some research, I was reading some articles, watching some videos about, about big, da big data. And the definition of big data is data that contains greater, greater variety, arriving in increasing volume and with more velocity. This is known as a uh, 3Vs. So big data it describes a large volume of varied data, uh, both structured and unstructured, that are used as the as a tool to detect pattern patterns and trends of behavior that serve to carry out predictive predictive and pres prescriptive analysis. This massive volumes of data uh, can be used to address business problems that you wouldn't uh, you wouldn't have be able to a big data serves so that stored remotely can be used by companies as the basis for their decision making uh, we live in these days that every company is taking decisions to increase on sales to increase on customers customer experience and so companies are using big data nowadays to increase in uh, the results. And so uh, even companies can, can increase analysis of user behavior, extracting the value of the stored data and formulating predictions through the observed patterns uh, tackled before. Uh, so big data is categorized in five categories. The first one is data generated by people through social media, through messaging, through email or service. The second category is, is data generated by transactions through calling such, such as calling, callings, billings and access to Wi-Fi. We, we use Wi-Fi every day. And the third category is data generated by electronics, uh, ele by electronic marketing and web. This data is generated when people surf through internet and we are surfing the internet every day. Every day we are searching some things, almost everything on Google, on Safari and other search engines. And so the fourth category is data generated by machine to machine interactions such as uh, gauges, temperature sensor, light sensors, uh, height, pressure. And the fifth category is uh, these are biometric data generated by biometric uh, readers such as retina scanner, fingerprint scanner, and DNA strand uh, readers. So as you know, there there's a lot of data of big data of big data. There's a lot of information about big data. And but how how does does big data apply to to the real life or to businesses? I was uh, making some research and I found a lot of uh, examples uh, of data big data use cases. But I decided to show you two cases. For example, in product development, companies such as PNG and Netflix are using big data to anticipate customer demand and they build predictive models for new products and services by classifying key attrib attributes of past and current products of services and modeling the relationships between those attributes and the commercial success of the offering. And so, as we can see, companies are using big data for product development and other companies are using big data for customer experience. Uh, there are companies that use this to have a clear view of customer experience is more possible now than ever before. Big data enables you to gather data from social media, web visits, call logs and other sources to improve the interaction experience and maximize the value delivered. Uh, start delivering personalized offers, reduce customer churn, and handle issues proactively.
as you can see big data is is very used nowadays and there's a lot of data that people are creating every single day and this data is storaged in amount of vol volumes and this data can be used in a better way to improve businesses to improve um, entrepreneurs and to improve new new studies new researches and medicine um, marketing and a lot of things so every day we're creating data and we're using data thank you so much